What is this big rock? Turns out it's a dinosaur turd. 27 pounder. Looks like metal melted by some great heat. It has three holes where something used to be. Some strange cipher is inscribed here. But you can't read it. Ah, well darn it. I talk to any of these statues. Was this supposed to be like a spaceship or something? I don't quite remember how the end of this game goes. Another dungeon, really? Oh, jeez. Something popped up on the screen, but I didn't see what it was. Also, secret passage here? In the very first room? Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah for rewarding exploration, my man. This is what I'm talking about. I'm just gonna keep checking the right wall because I'm not greedy enough as it is. Go this way. Fire the rats. Well, now I wonder what would have happened if I would have gone the normal way. Jeez. Holy crap, dude. Hang on a second. Oh! Okay, I'm back. Sorry, I had to move my clothes over from the washer to the dryer. I told myself I was going to do that in between two of these videos, and I never did it. Ugh. I don't like the look of those traps. Wait, what is that? Ooh, I think I remember that. Isn't that that weapon that, like, um... Where you throw it and then it splits up into two? And this looks like exactly the kind of room where you would use it. Nice! Dude! Give me those hearts, even though I don't need them. Ooh, you have to time that throw pretty well, though. Mm-hmm. I suppose we should make sure here. Make sure there's nothing else in the room. I'm just gonna take it on faith that there isn't. And that this was just a room to demonstrate the weapon. Okay. Oh, God! Okay, okay. Fine, I won't fall for that again. Well, I get it, alright. Okay, sure. It's gonna time your jumps. Oh, I don't know what to say. Don't have much life left. Well, I definitely don't now. Man, everything does so much damage in these later dungeons, too. Of course, I guess they figure at this point, if you're getting hit by stuff that you've clearly already seen the attack patterns to, then it's your fault you got hit, you know? It's your fault you got hit, not the game's! Now that was too well. Uh, now I'm gonna try up. Ow, ow, ow! Don't punch me in the stomach, man. You're a bat. You can't punch me in the stomach. You don't even have arms. Besides, you mess up my hair. What are those? Are those like Zelda bubbles? If so, I'm not a fan. I can already tell you. I don't like how they're moving diagonally. Whatever that is, that's exactly what they are. They don't do any damage, thankfully. <laughs> okay, so far so good here. Oh, look at this. Here, hang on. Looks like I was standing on something for a second there, though. How weird is that? Ow! Jeez, just comes up from the floor? Just instantly stabs you, man. No, move, move! You gotta move! You can't be standing in one spot like that. Okay, so nothing on the other two blocks in this room. Glad I got a chance to check those at least. That was the plan, pretty much, from the beginning, anyway. I'm trying to hit those things without hitting the middle thing. To... Yeah. 
jumps too soon. Oh, hey there, classic mama. You know what, let's find out what would have happened if we would have gone straight at the beginning of that dungeon. Because now I'm curious. There apparently is more dungeon here. Maybe this is like the easy route or something. I just don't get as many rewards or whatever. Or maybe it just takes you to a dead end. Where endless torment awaits. Oh, we didn't try left over here, did we? Let's try left. Let's see what happens. Oh, it's just hearts. Well, that's actually a huge relief. But who knows, there might be even more in here. Ah! Let's check all the blocks just to make sure. Wow. Wouldn't have expected them to drop that much, you know, help in a dungeon like this. I thought this was like no mercy town or something here. Also, apparently, sometimes the best way to handle these bad rooms is just run up into the middle. Who would have thunk it? Nice. Sweet. Okay, cool. Now we're playing with power here, let me tell you. Okay, so it looks like, uh... Like, I don't need the hearts, but... How am I gonna get... Across? Wait, is there like a... There we go, nice! Oh man, I'm so smart sometimes. Like, it was either that or it's another invisible block. I mean, I was... Good God Almighty. I don't know what this guy's doing. Well, I know what he's doing. And I don't know if I like it. Okay, well, this might be a good time to utilize this thing, then. I only have so many shots of it, though. Stop getting next to him. Okay, okay, okay. Jeez. Alright, 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 alright. Just hang in there. We almost got it over the doors and have to spam it. Yes! Oh! Oh! Oh, man. That was the worst thing I could have done. But I don't know what else, actually, that I would have done. Ooh, free lives, but I don't even want them. But, ooh! Alrighty, then. Continuing on. Well, there's some refills on our much needed supplies here. Oh, we may need even more than that, though. Oh, it's gonna give it to us, too. Thank you, good sir. Thank you, little John. But I'm sure we're not invited. This room again? Interesting. Okay, here, let's just get this, get this ready. Okay, cool. Nice, now that's maneuvering right there. That's using your tinker, or your head, or whatever, what's... This guy's weird. Kinda like that boss we just fought. Jeez. I'm having a bit of a time following his movements here. Jeez, I can't get a hit in on him. Wow. Good 
lord, man. Okay, yeah, let's, uh, let's do that over, I suppose. Nice drop by the snake there. Let's see if we can do this again. Okay, so it seems like he appears, he goes in one direction until he stops and then he materializes. So you have to just be ready. Alright. Yeah, this makes sense. Just gotta watch him. Nope. I almost had it. It's a little too early. There we go. Nice. Okay, that wasn't anywhere near as bad. But if I have to fight multiples of those, that could get very dirty, very nasty. And very fast, too. At least I'm learning how to kind of run away from those a little better. It's not like their attack pattern is that complicated. It's just... Somehow they just happen to run into you, you know? Obviously, they set themselves up so that they will, which is why they do. It's not really that big a deal, you know? Anyway... I'm starting to feel like I'm in Willy Wonka's... Uh, what did I just say? Okay, this isn't so bad. Yeah, 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 those, those aren't bad at all. I changed my mind, those aren't bad at all. I mean, they don't even do anything, really. It's like, they just... They go in one direction, you know? And these knives coming out of the ground aren't too bad either, because, again, they only go in one direction. So, kind of, just as long as you're constantly moving, you kind of really don't have to worry at all, do you? What is this? It's Homer Simpson looking mummy here. All I know is I don't want to be standing in front of him for any longer than a microsecond or two. Oh, there's so many like weird monsters in here though. Go ahead and hit me because I kinda don't care. I'm trying to get in a position where I'm not like Oh, jeez. Talk about just wandering in by accident here. What is this room? Why is this here? Are there ghosts in here? Okay, these aren't so bad. They're not, like, doing anything, though. I thought they were gonna come out with some attack and start, like, firing at me or something. Oops. Wait, you, you know, kind of like I do to them. Okay. Oh. So now I'll go in the other room. Oh wait, do I go down from there? Wait a minute. Aha! Okay, got myself a potion. Very nice, very nice. More stars. More throwing stars. <laughs> this reminds me of this one time in school. Like, you know, my, um... My teachers were, like, reading over the lists of stuff that wasn't allowed to be brought into the school. And he just reads over this list so nonchalantly, like... No guns, no, uh... You know, no knives, no brass knuckles, no throwing stars. And I'm just like... Who the hell would bring a throwing star to school? Like, that's silly. Throwing stars. You know, I've never seen a throwing star in my life. Pretty sure I haven't. Shoot. Stop with the resistance attacks. I hate him.
Well, you know, it does fly all over the place, can't you? Okay, well, that's good to know. Man, I kind of wish now that I hadn't lost that life from the sun. We're getting there, though. That's the thing. We're getting there. We just have to keep trying. The impossible is possible. Uh oh, I just found something. Jeez. Oh, it's just stars. Okay. Just another way into this room, which we see later on, so... Wow. <laughs> so lucky thing I checked that. I suppose we could break back in here. Whoops, well, do. Not if you're gonna do that. Of course, we already know there's a way out of this room. We don't even have to fight these dudes. Just go in here. Jump across. Jump down. Check the things here. Pick up your much needed supplies. Now we have 70 of those stars. Damn, that's not bad at all. I guess we're gonna need them for this. Man, if there was a way you could hit both of those at the same time, that'd be pretty rad. Sometimes you can. <laughs> one. Ah, they were both down to the last hit at the same time. I was gonna say, man, it felt like those were taking a while. They were making me a little bit nervous. Um, and then again, you know what? There have been, like, so many passageways in this dungeon that I want to, like, check every single wall here now. This is another boss here. I was just saying that now, I didn't mean it, jeez. I'm gonna try it. I am. Yup. What did I tell ya? Okay, but there's still... Light in here somewhere. <laughs> I have no idea. I mean, if that's the case, there's like two switches I'm not finding here. Oh, wait. Oh, it's just more of those. Well, I don't care about that. I care about the hearts. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Perfect. That block is sinking, though. Oh, that's not even a block, dude. There's nothing like killing two heads with one stone, baby. Two heads with one star. You know what, just because I finished the dungeon, judging by the sound of the music, doesn't mean we're done with the secret passages yet, right? 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 Maybe not? Did we seriously just do that? Man. The more I see this screen right here, the more unbelievable it is to me every time I see it. This is getting crazy now, I don't know. Uh, we must be really close to the end of this by now, though. I can only imagine. Nothing there. Hey, this kind of reminds me of a cave in Final Fantasy IV. Except in IV, there's like an exit right up over here. And then if you go down this way, there's a treasure chest with a shadow blade in it. 
upgrade for Cecil's weaponry, which is of little consequence because he has no use for it once he becomes a paladin. You know, a paladin. Oh, check it out, it's Peter Griffin. Oh, oh wait, is that my uncle? I guess we'll have to find out next time. Man, this is the stupidest cliffhanger I've ever come up with.